Hello everybody, it's Eva from Zobby Tiger here again and today I would like to share with you my latest journal I made. Uh, I'm crafting with you with all this amazing crafting family two and a half years and I have to say in science I saw first journal and science I saw first that shabby chic and vintage and that ladies journal I always wanted to make one but I didn't feel that way I I, I tried many times before but it was horrible <laughs> but now I don't know <laughs> maybe I'm too old or <laughs> maybe it's because this beautiful sunshine or, or I don't know why I felt that um, I'm gonna try it again so last few days I think more than one week uh, I watched so many videos on YouTube I think thousand videos on YouTube I uh, saw hundreds hundreds pictures on Pinterest on Google and I tried to make my vintage ladies romantic junk journal and I have to say I really like it I'm so surprised I did it uh, this journal was already sewn together it was with gold cover uh, and inside was already sewn six signatures with uh, blank pages and I decided that I'm going to try just decorate those pages uh, with every single stars I, I saw and I liked everywhere I saw it on Google on Pinterest on YouTube everywhere so I would like to share with you what I learned from you, from your amazing ladies. <laughs> I'm, I'm totally surprised <laughs> how lovely it looks. <laughs> I used many laces, few, um, few, few charms inside, many pearls inside. I saw it inside. I'm so surprised I did it. It was took longer time than I thought because, you know, sometimes I can't just hold that needle, but. I think it's worth it. Uh, here I made pocket on that cover, so I can all that I change. It will be probably not for me because I wanna try another one, so this will be probably for sale. I will see, I think it will be for sale. I include in this journal many ephemeras, many photos, because I like it. Uh, when I saw those journals, I always liked uh, when they was full of photos and ephemeras, you know, to have something to watch, to have something to read. So I include many of those pictures, ephemeras inside. This is my cover. Uh, on that gold uh, cover, I use this beautiful vintage lace. Then I used here on bottom one scallop lace with this beautiful texture then I use this lace I don't know how you call it this lace with those it's not feathers <laughs> but with those strings oh, sorry I'm out of you and with those beads and it's really beautiful I think it's just pop at the bottom of the tunnel and then I use this uh, beautiful oh my gosh how you say so, so this one it's lace uh, it's I've got it on my thong. I can't remember that word. This beautiful piece of lace. I know that word, but I can't remember now. I'm sorry. And here I made some small bowl out of my rest of lace. It's this one, which I used for closure. So I made small bowl here and I put together this small charm. This journal is closing on those two laces. I will put it back because if I will stuck it here, I will don't remember where I place it. So it's closing just like this and it's really thick. As you can see, it's really thick. <laughs> I really enjoyed that. It was so fun and I, I like <laughs> how it turns out. So on this first page, I made small pocket here. Pockets, many small pockets. Uh, I made one long pocket, no, oh, two pockets here from laces and here you can see I saw inside those pearls, small pearls, it's two different laces and I saw inside those small pearls and I made one pocket here 
using a card and it can be open like this I don't know where I see that those pages but I really like it I saw a few videos with pages like this and I put that this ephemera here is small pocket in all journal I used few stamps on those empty pages blank pages and those pages uh, are from a really great I think it's handmade paper because it's a really great quality. It's beautiful paper. So I include those cards and those uh, photos. And you will see I used really a lot of laces and trims. Here this beautiful vintage image uh, I think I downloaded uh from pinterest it's like freebie here i made pocket out of this beautiful peachy color lace and again i include old postcard i made few stamps and here i used those small bows to match all those together and i include those beautiful vintage ladies and again some ephemera and I all, uh, all this stuff is distressed uh, with vintage photo Tim Holtz distress ink Ranger distress ink and here is one pocket I made it uh, when I glued piece of fabric on this paper so I made small pocket here and I put there just this tag and then I made Double pocket here, or triple po pocket here. <laughs> it's small pocket here behind this ephemera. Small pocket here, like tuck. And small pocket behind. And as you can see, I again include few vintage photos. Uh, this pocket here, I use that book page, which I fold like tuck. I used a lot of my laces. Eek, come on, open. Here I used small doily, pink doily, and then I glued on top of that doily this beautiful clocks with beard inside. I really like this image, it's beautiful. And I made it like tuck spots. And I include there again some ephemeras, some uh, beautiful vintage pictures like this uh, here uh, I saw on many journals those small envelopes so I include one in my journal as well and I put there this lady which is on front cover as well she's here as you can see I like this lady it's beautiful I used a few of my stamps. Here I made pocket when I glued on that previous page. I glued this beautiful ephemera image. So I made pocket here. And I put there images which I download from Pinterest. All of them I think I download from Pinterest. here and everything I have to print out <laughs> very small <laughs> because it's very small journal <laughs> I like this one it's uh, actually image of napkins but I really like this image so I download it as well here I made small text spot and I uh, used many balls here and small pearl and I put that those ladies oh I'm kind of out of view and here you can see, I saw so many pearls on this page because I really like it. It's actually kind of tuck spot here. And I decorated with lace and with those pearls from both sides. And here I used, uh, again, I like to use acetate pieces. So I use it here. I made it again like a pocket. And I put there 
this paper clip and here I download how hard it was to wear those huge uh, corset corset dresses how hard it was to wear to get <laughs> this dress on you <laughs> so I include there this beautiful pictures it's in this pocket as you can see this journal has so many pockets but so many spaces for journaling as well again few my stamps and this is kind of double pocket page it has pocket behind this beautiful picture with that small girl it has one pocket and other pocket it has here like huge one again some image of old vintage city this beautiful girl and I found those jokes animate jokes so I included in this journal as well here and there here I made tax spot using a book page doily and then a small doily which I made out of tissue paper and I include uh, I glued down this cameo and I put behind those images it's tax spot from this side and from that other side as well and I include again some images here we have another pocket and again some ephemera which I download from, from Pinterest. I really like those, those vintage images. They are really beautiful. And I include this beautiful man in that pocket. Because as woman I will uh, have interest about, about men. Isn't it? <laughs> it doesn't matter which age I'm living. <laughs> and here, here we've got... Uh, like a postcard front page of La Petite Journal, which is really brilliant. And as you can see, I, <laughs> I decorate again that can pull. <laughs> I used some uh, old paper here, like decoration. Again, I used a glossy accent to make it like uh, a glass. And on the top, I saw small bowl with that huge pearl. And I think it's beautiful. <laughs> It's so soft now, even if it can pull. <laughs> it looks good. So it's like my paper clip. And here I made tuck spot. Again, I include beautiful images. Uh, I've got quite a few of those images in this journal. Uh, it was uh, it was book of uh, like items book from old uh, old shop and uh, I downloaded it just because name of that shop, shop was Rodrem and Corporation and I am living in Rodrem <laughs> so I was totally surprised and I had to download that book so all those images which I downloaded have got all book in my in my computer and it's really amazing it has <clears throat> all those images of um, what is there? Uh, like buttons, uh, all all this stuff for uh, for sewing. So I download this book. I will try to find uh, where to find web page where I found this uh, this book. If I will find it, I will put it uh, put link down below. If I will don't find it, I will try to download all those uh, images to my blog. But I'm a little bit lost in that blogging, so. Give me time, please bear with me. I will find out way how to do it. Here's a small photo of those beautiful pets. I really like it. <laughs> if my my son will see that, he will be probably so sad. <laughs> and I really like this small baby. It's so gorgeous. It's so cute. Here another page of that book. And it's really cool. I really like it. It's all vintage images ephemera images here i made <coughs> small <coughs> pardon me small um, pocket 
And again, I include old photo and this advert. And I have to say that I really enjoy it. After I saw so many videos, I was thinking I have to try it. I really have to try it. Here I made kind of secret, secret page. When you open this one, you've got space for journaling. And you can put it back and nobody will see that. <laughs> so it's a secret page there. Here again, a tuck spot with this uh, brooch, brook. Brooks, Brooch, oh my god, I don't know how says say name of this city. And this beautiful vintage lady. Probably I have to be more faster. Here, uh, I think I saw, you know, those layers with hearts. I saw it, I think, uh, on Michelle channel in her last video, I think, and I really like it. It's not perfect yet, but I, I really like that idea to make layers and to make embellishment out of that. Again, a few ephemeras and my paper clip, which I decorate again. <laughs> Here again, I made that lace pocket, my small tuck with dog, and I use this, um, this die, this Tim Holtz uh, label die. Like my tag, and here small tags. <sighs> yeah, this journal is oh, I I like Lily Ellis. She was I think most photographed uh, Edwardian lady, and she was she was really beautiful. I like I like her. I think my next romantic journal will be about her. I think so. And here in this page I made kind of double pocket for two tacks. I used again that uh, no, ephemera, uh, acetate piece with stamp and I made pocket here for one tack. <laughs> and I really like this, this image. Can you see that baby? <laughs> it's hilarious. <laughs> Oops. And from other side it's made like postcard. So it's oops la go there shoop mm -hmm. it's here one pocket and other one it's on bottom and i use this beautiful lady and i put it just on book page oops la it's like small tuck so it's here my double pocket here <clears throat> just some advert, vintage advert, again my paper clip, decorated paper clip. Here you can see I tried that uh, layers with hearts again, but this time with ball and with pearl and it, it looks a little bit better. I will try it again, <laughs> somehow. <laughs> and I made pocket from lace again. And I made this small tag. Here I made again a pocket used with fabric and it's large pocket there. It's from this top side. Can you see that? Here is one pocket. Large one and here I made small pocket again and I use this beautiful lady and I put there this ephemera. I know it's always just some pockets. Again, my can pull, decorated can pull. Here is small pocket with beautiful uh, Victorian lady. This was advert for Lotto for uh, winning some prizes. And here it was uh, just postcard with bicycle. I included there. Here I used my doily and again uh, I cut out small doily from tissue paper and this is that Tim Holtz labels die from book page and again some ephemera and same as from that other side same tuck spot and here you can see another 
image from that Rodrem book. <laughs> I really like this photo. I think this man will be included in most of my journals because it <laughs> just just awesome. It's made me happy. <laughs> His face. Few my stamps. And here I made small window <laughs> using uh, this acetate piece. I made small window and I made pocket behind. It's like this. So it can be there some a photo. Here again a small stamps. Uh, pocket from this beautiful peachy lace and again I saw uh, those pearls in it on it here uh, you've been so much in my thoughts and knew I I had to drop you a line to tell you I think <laughs> I'm reading horribly but hopefully you know <laughs> you know what is here it's like a uh, leather leather paper no leather letter paper <laughs> letter paper <laughs> here's few stamps again few laces this is another image from that Rodrem book and I really like this book all those images are awesome I think it's from 1920 that book it was like catalog, like SARS, you know. So it was like catalog for all products they sell. Here's some ephemera. I will try to find that page where I download it. And here I used again that yep, this book, uh, book, this page. I really like the system that hides space. Here is pocket out of lace, and I include there some advert for Nestle milk. This Nestlé milk is in this pocket. And here, as you can see, again, pets, those beautiful dogs on a vintage photo. And here behind that, I've got another pocket with this beautiful lady. And I think I'm, I'm gonna definitely do more those beautiful, soft journals. Here I try to make kind of my normal style and I tried to make it softer <laughs> and I think if I will use next time here some gem maybe it will be better than now but I like it like this here I made small tag with pocket and I included a uh, small advert this small advert and also those meal tickets Meat tickets, meal tickets, and this beautiful lady. I know I have to be hurry, it's too long right now. Nothing excited. Here I made another pocket using this beautiful ephemera from Pinterest, and this one I found on Google. It was advert for wife, wives. You know, husband and wife. So, wives. It's here, wives, but I know. Uh, vives. <laughs> wives. And if you will read that, it's... Oh my gosh. I'm so sorry with women <laughs> in the 19th century. I'm gonna be probably killed <laughs> by someone because I can't do what is, what is here. You can't argue with husband, you always have to do what they want, you know. Wow, it was so hard for women. They have to be just shut up. Wow, <laughs> I like that. I don't like to do it, but I like this <laughs> this advice. So I included this in this journal as well. And we are nearly on the end of my first <laughs> soft romantic journal. Here, another lady. And another uh, advert. I really like those old adverts. They have something, something special. They are nice. Yeah, and this is end of my journal. So as you can see, I didn't sew those papers in the journal, but I decorate nearly every single one. I think every single one. And it's really thick, and I really enjoy it.
and I hope that I will make some another one. I know I will make some another one. I really like it. And ladies, you you are my huge inspiration because what you doing it's just breathtaking. Really, I like all those romantic women journals, those uh, with sewing. Oh, sewing theme. And, and we are losing eh, our charm, so I have to put it back. So this is my small journal. I really hope you like it. I really like it. <laughs> I really enjoy it. I think I like all that shiny stuff, all this. Eh? <laughs> all this one, all those petals. <laughs> I have to make some another one and bigger. So thank you so much for, for watching. Thank you for all your inspiration. And hopefully see you soon. Have a lovely day and see you next time. Bye.